Hello students, welcome to the YouTube channel Eternal AC Education. In this session, you are going to learn Chapter 3, Database Management System, Part 9. Content of the session is MySQL Administration Open Source Software Tools. So, you are going to learn some of the open source software tools of MySQL. Before that, you should know some of the basic concepts. What is a desktop application and what is a web application? An application that runs standalone in a desktop or laptop computer is said to be the desktop application. Computer based software programs that are stored locally on an operating system of the device. For example, Microsoft Office application, Word, Excel, etc. Simply, when you open the computer, when you press the start button, what are the list available in your all programs is said to be desktop application. Then what about web application? An application software that runs on a web server. An application are accessed by the user through a web server, web browser with an active internet connection. For example, your online retail sales. You know many of the online shopping websites online banking system these applications are said to be web applications now our chapter is database management system you know database is a collection of tables many databases are in existence to meet our need of the application these databases are broadly divided into heavy databases light databases Heavy Databases supports all the desktop applications. Live Database supports all the web applications. I hope you remember what is desktop application and what is web application. Heavy Database supports all the desktop application. Live Database support all the web applications. Heavy databases did not meet out the network issues efficiently, but light databases were able to handle all the issues raised by the network. Because of this, many of the heavy databases are now converting into light databases. So, all the light databases that supports the, supports the web applications are known as web databases. So, Database is a collection of table and it is going to maintain the data in a table format. Among the database, it can be a heavy or light. Heavy means it will support desktop application. Light means it will support web application. But the emerging technology is making, to, making the user to use more web applications. So, the light databases that supports the web applications are known as web databases. Here I have given some of the commonly used databases which is in your book SAP, Sybase, MySQL, DB2, O5BM, Oracle, SQL Server, SQL, SQLite. So now Types of software tools. Many open source tools are available in the market to design the database in a better and efficient manner. Do you remember the word open source? Open source means it is freely available from net and it can be edited. This is the two properties of a open source. PHP my admin is the most popular for web administration i hope you remember this we had seen the video for how to install that php my admin using the exam web server the popular desktop application tools are mysql workbench and highly sql so you know that there are two databases heavy and light so php my admin is light because it supports web applications MySQL Workbench and Heidi are desktop supporting heavy databases. 
So MySQL Workbench, it is a database tool used by developers and DBAs mainly for visualization. This tool helps in data modeling, development of a SQL server configuration and backup for MySQL in a better way. Its basic release version is 5.0 and is now in 8.0 supporting all operating system. The meaning is it can work with Windows, Mac, Linux, so and so. The SQL editor of this tool is very flexible and comfortable in dealing multiple results set. They are given only the theory part about this. We are not going to work with this software in your syllabus. Hide SQL. This open source tool helps in the administration of better database system. It supports GUI, graphical user interface features for monitoring, server host, server connection, databases, tables, views, triggers and events. These are the things which are related with the database management. But apart from table, views, triggers, events are not in your syllabus. But surely you will learn when you learn Oracle in your higher studies. PHP MyAdmin. This administrative tool of MySQL is a web application written in PHP. And the next chapter you are going to learn PHP. You are having six, six chapters regarding PHP in your 12th standard syllabus. So we will see this later in detail. They are used predominantly in web hosting. The main feature is providing web interface, importing data from CSV and exporting data to various formats. It generates live charts for monitoring MySQL server activities like connections, processes and memory usage. It also helps in making the complex queries easier. Regarding PHP MyAdmin also, your syllabus is having only little bit. I will explain what are the things given in your syllabus in the following videos. But you have to learn more to have more knowledge about this SQL. That means structured query language. It is a very interesting chapter or interesting concept also to learn. So when you are having free time, learn more about by browsing in internet. Before that, you have to install your exam web server. So we will have a recap what we learnt in this session. Desktop applications. Runs on desktop OS. What is web applications? Runs on web browser. Without the browser, I cannot run our web applications. What is heavy database? Supports desktop applications are said to be heavy database. What is light database? Which supports web applications are said to be light database. What is web database? Light databases that supports the web applications are said to be web database. Is it clear children? Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, subscribe this channel to watch the upcoming videos. Thank you. Have a good day.